and Minecraft Electra Wings make you fly. Today, we're gonna try that in real life. This is a giant, real life Electra Wing. Good luck, James. Make it to the beach. Good luck. <laughs> did it that work? Did not work. It did not work, but it okay. Was a lighter fall. I think this will work if James had a little bit more speed. This is a terrible idea. <laughs> I don't think this is gonna work. No, this does not work. So through this entire video, we're gonna be testing things from Minecraft to see how realistic the game actually is. Be sure to watch till the end of the video to see if Minecraft is actually realistic. Can you make a fire aspect arrow in real life? Oh, okay. oh there it is. You see the flame? Look at that. Oh! oh. Did you hear it? Oh, it's that still on fire. Was sick. Do you hear the sound it made, bro? And it's still going. You can make a fire aspect arrow in real life. We have successfully made a cobblestone generator in real life. We're gonna pour water on one side, molten lava on the other side, and then pull the middle and see if it works just like it does in Minecraft. All right, so here is our water. Go ahead and pour the lava. All right, now pull it, Gabe. Pull the middle. Um, it's smoking a lot. Doesn't really smoke in Minecraft. I think our water to lava ratio might have messed up. We might have made obsidian instead, boys. So this is what we have made. I mean, I guess it kind of looks like a cobblestone block. It looks like burnt pizza. Technically, it did work. The water and the lava came together and made a solid. You know, I would say this is true. It gave us a block, a very skinny one. A crossbow in Minecraft can shoot approximately 410 feet. But can a crossbow do that in real life? We have a red marker out there that is approximately 410 feet away from us. You ready? Launch that boy. Ooh, you probably went 600 feet. I think I aimed a little high. <laughs> Let's go try to find the arrow. This is our marker for 410 feet, but it kept going all the way over here. And this is where the arrow landed, probably about 100 feet away from our marker. A crossbow in real life can shoot way further than in Minecraft. In Minecraft, goats can jump, but can we make a goat jump? Please, come on. Oh, oh. That's a good boy. Look at that boy. Oh, you got some sharp teeth. Can you jump 30 blocks high? No? I think that's as high as he's going. I bet if you crouch down, we can get him to jump on your back. Good. <laughs> <laughs> he kind of jumped. Yeah, what if he pees on you? If this goat pees on me, I'm going to kill y'all. That's about max altitude we're hitting right now. In Minecraft, you can melt iron and turn it into an ingot. But are you able to do that in real life? And pour. Oh, nice. Let's see if we have an ingot. Whoa, look at that. That's an ingot. That's pretty good. Uh, that is clearly an iron ingot that we have just forged in real life. In Minecraft, if you throw anything at a cactus, it's basically a trash can. We're gonna see if that works in real life. Nice. Egg. Lizzie. Egg. Thor's hammer. Melon. No, melon. No, melon. Melon, Melon is part of the water now. I would like to say that cactuses in real life are not trash cans. However, they are very dangerous and very sharp. <laughs> A boat in Minecraft is just made out of wood, but if we build it in real life, will it actually float? Push me out, boys. It's leaking. No way, where? Push him out. Push oh, him out. It is leaking. Kick him out. Kick him out. As you can see, I am floating in the water. Unfortunately, we do have a little bit of a, a leak here, as you can see, but it is okay because it, it floats, boys. It floats like we're, we're chilling. Yo, what do y'all think? It works. Confirmed. Can a Minecraft shield stop? Can a Minecraft shield stop a bow and arrow? That's what I meant to say. Boom. Oh, wow. Bounce right off. I would say great success. But can it stop the bow itself? bow is stronger than the arrow. In Minecraft, if you throw an egg, it will spawn a chicken. Blah. Unfortunately, we are not seeing any chickens here. Hey, maybe it's because the eggs are expired. <laughs> in Minecraft, Steve can throw a trident 282 feet. So we bought a trident in real life. <laughs> this thing is solid metal. Now the question is, can we throw it 282 feet? All right, I'm gonna get a running start for this. Watch out. Dude, this thing's so heavy. All right, ready? Landed there. What we got? 22 feet, four inches. That's it? All right, James, you give it a try. James is way stronger than me. He hits the gym. Oh, stop. Oh! Oh, <laughs> uh, James, you broke it. 
Oh, dang it. All right, let go of it. <laughs> um, unfortunately, we cannot measure no, you break the rest the of it. Dang. Wait, hold on, what? hold on, hold on. Right, okay, stay right there. Yeah, so that's go. 25 feet. Okay, what's 25 plus 14? 39. 39 feet. So no, you cannot do this in real life. I'm pretty sure Steve is like a legit superhero. That is insane. You shall not pass. This is slime. And if you take a Minecraft boat and put it in slime, you can apparently make it bounce. Let's see how bouncy it is. I think a trampoline's way better. Just jump on a trampoline. What is that? <laughs> in Minecraft, there's basically no weight. A player can hold 63,936 items. They could be all solid diamond blocks, or they could all just be sticks. But we're gonna see if I can hold 63,000 items. This is 55,000 Orbeez. Oh, bro, that's getting heavy. You're about halfway through. <laughs> I can't feel my neck. It's so heavy. All right, the backpack's full. And here's another 7,000 Orbeez. Carrots. 30 flowers. Now we're currently at 61,000 items, and I'm carrying it. I can barely stand, but you know, it's gonna work. We're gonna travel across the world. You look like you're struggling, bruh. I am indeed struggling. On the road again. Chainmail armor in Minecraft is able to block arrows. It seems to work, honestly. Bruce, it's coming. Oh, right in the shoulder. <laughs> oh my gosh. As you can see, the armor did not stop the arrow. Is Bruce dead? He lost his arm. So it actually hit the chain armor. Look at this, it completely broke it. The armor just like basically ripped apart. And this is real chain mail armor. This is false. It does not work. When you shoot a Minecraft boat with a bow and arrow, it goes back to its original pieces. However, it does not work in real life. Come on, bro. I'm trying to return this wood back to Home Depot. Buy our ass back, arrow. Yep, that did. Okay, you can't do it. It's not possible. In Minecraft, if you... Minecraft, if you take two buckets and pour them into something, you can make an infinite water source. Apparently, right now, this is an infinite water source. Let's test that. That's one bucket. That's two buckets. Three buckets. Three buckets. Four buckets. Five bucks. Oh, my water is getting lower. No, you cannot make an infinite water source in real life. Carrot on a stick can guide a pig in Minecraft, but does that work in real life? They seem a little distracted. Hello, piggy. Do you want the carrot? Excuse me. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. You don't care about it. Nope. Yeah. Yeah, they, they have zero cares about carrots. Upgraded to a watermelon on a stick. I know this isn't in Minecraft, but let's just see if it works. Hello, friends. Hey. <laughs> oh, oh, whoa, 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 you actually want it. That was instant. Come on. Oh my gosh, look at that. Watermelon on a stick does work. Oh, oh yeah, you like that? Has it had mighty scrumptious? Oh, are you gonna take the whole thing? You can dig straight down in Minecraft, but it's really risky. But what happens if you dig straight down in real life? <laughs> Well, first off, I can tell you it's way more labor intensive. Bro, there's a whole tree under here. We're gonna try to make it all the way to bedrock. That's right, boys. We're going to the core of the earth. I think we've officially made it one block deep. Maybe one and a half. In Minecraft, a fishing rod is made with sticks and a string. So we decided to make one in real life and see if we're gonna actually catch something. Here you go, James. If you catch something, I will give you $1,000. <laughs> oh, Sam, say less. Also, I'm coming with you. This is the ultimate boat test. Can it actually fit two players? No, Seymour, Seymour. Oh, bro, there's so much water <laughs> in here. <laughs> we're sailing out to the sea. Ah, Ow. sorry, bro. <laughs> we're looking for the big pieces of salmon. We looking, got the glizzy. the glizzy? Wow, yeah. look at that. Oh, there you go. We're slowly sinking, and you have to catch a fish. Otherwise, you're gonna miss out on a thousand dollars, right, you? Bro, bro, <laughs> we're gonna flip. No, this sucks. No way this dude's gonna catch a single thing. So far, it looks like we are not getting any bobs. You wanna go to Long John Silver's and yeah, catch a fish there? I give up. This is how you craft a cake in Minecraft. This is the exact recipe. We have three pieces of wheat, 
two pieces of sugar, an egg, and then three glasses or buckets of milk. We're going to mix all these together and see if they will actually make a cake. It doesn't have to look like a Minecraft cake. It just has to taste like a cake. Egg. <laughs> One, two, three. All right, so mix that up, put it in a pan, and that should make a cake. Give that boy a smell. Does that smell like cake? No. It has potential. Let's bake it. Yeet! We're just gonna check on it every like 10 minutes. This is real obsidian. We're gonna see if we can break it in nine seconds, just like in Minecraft. Start. Hurry up. I'm missing. Oh, I saw a spark. You have four seconds. Oh, I did it! It oh. broke! It did break in half. Broke in how in, many seconds? It was seven. I was a diamond pickaxe, bro. I mean, look at it. I mean, usually obsidian doesn't move, so. Yeah, it tried to run away. I would say, I think it works. Home on the range. Oh yeah, that boy thick. So, um, I made it probably about two and a half blocks deep. You can dig straight down. I don't know why you would want to in real life. It took us all day just to do two and a half blocks deep. <laughs> oh, it's wet down there. Does an anvil work in real life? This is our forge, and this is going to be a sword. Oh yeah. We had to heat up the metal to approximately thousands of degrees, and now we're bashing it with a hammer. It's definitely a lot more difficult in uh, real life than it is in Minecraft. I need a bigger hammer. I think it's pretty sharp. It's definitely not a diamond sword but it'll get the job done. Will the sword that we forged from an anvil cut? Go ahead. Oh! I mean, it works. Okay. All right, this is our Minecraft cake. Pretty sure that thing is not done. Oh, oh yeah. Kind of looks like biscuits up. and gravy. Ah, bruh. It's not the prettiest looking cake. It looks like mashed potatoes. Moment of truth. Doesn't taste like cake. Looks like crap. Yeah, blow on it, give it a nice. Cake with no flavor, yeah. It's cake. It is, I mean, it's not bad, it just doesn't have like flavor. It's like a really sweet, really boring, really wet biscuit. It might be a vibe. Yeah, it's that like tastes like cake with absolutely no flavoring. <coughs> it's pretty good. In Minecraft, you can break your fall using a boat. We're gonna see if that works in real life. This is uh, Steve. These are his melons, which basically represents his lives. If any of these melons break, he loses a life. And we just gotta drop it off this 30 foot drop right here. Three, two, one, go! Ooh. He's not alive. Oh, Steve is dead. Steve was a good man, a quiet man. Steve! Oh my gosh. Every single melon cracked, even this one. Steve! Steve! Why'd you do it, Steve? Why'd you do it? It wasn't me. It wasn't me. I swear. Yo, Jack! Yeah. <laughs> He's got melon. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> 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 <laughs>